I decided to change what we were doing last night. I wanted to make something I felt was even easier to understand and here are the different mode changes. And I wanted to make sure every different interval had equal play time. Meaning they're played in equal amounts except for the root note. That thing keeps getting played a bunch so we keep pedaling back to the main notes which is A. So uh, we got the Ionian mode to start with and this is our riff. So if you're talking about the intervals being played, we have the one, then the second interval, back to the root notes, third interval, root notes, fourth interval, root notes, fifth interval, root notes, sixth interval, root note, seventh interval, and then we're going to hit the root note at a higher octave. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, three, and repeat. One, two, one, three, one, four, one, five, one, six, one, seven, one, seven, six, five, four, three, two, three. And then we got. I changed how we're gonna uh, go from mode to mode. I think this might improve things as far as clarity. So Lydian, the only difference between Lydian and Ionian is a sharp four. Lydian takes the fourth interval and raises it up a half step. So again, you ask, how do you know which note needs to be changed? You need to count them. Fourth interval means the fourth note is changed. That's it. You just have to count. That's how you know. So Lydian, we got this. Mixolydian, the only difference between Ionian and Mixolydian is a flat seventh. So they're very similar to Ionian, just that one interval change. Now Aeolian is going to be the next one, which is your minor scale. So most music you listen to is considered based off of a major scale or a minor scale. So those first three modes are based around a major, well, they can be considered major modes because they have a one, three, and five interval. So the Ionian has a 1, 3, and 5, so does Lydian, and so does Mixolydian. That's why I put those three together, because they're very closely related. So your minor scale, or Aeolian mode, has a flat 3, flat 6, and flat 7, and the riff goes like this. Dorian mode is going to take the flat six in Aeolian and raise it up to a natural six. So the difference between an Aeolian mode and a Dorian mode is you raise the flat six up to a natural six. You can also look at it as the difference between Ionian and Dorian is a flat three and a flat seven. So here we go with the Dorian riff. Phrygian has a flat second, flat third, flat sixth, and flat seven. 
So that's one note difference from the minor scale. It just flats the second note in your minor scale, and that gives you a Phrygian mode. And I see on the tab that I wrote something wrong. I'm going to correct that now. I did it this way. I'm looking at the power or the uh, Guitar Pro file as I'm playing through this to make sure I have everything tabbed correctly. And I didn't. I goofed something. So here we go. Phrygian riff once again. Locrian is very close to the Phrygian mode. Locrian flats the 5 as well. So if you compare the Locrian mode to Ionian, everything is flat except the 4. The 1 is not flat because there's no such thing. If you flat the 1, you just have a new 1. The 1 can't be sharp or flat. However, I have seen someone name a mode found in harmonic minor as a mixolydian sharp one. I get what they're talking about, but I would argue that is an incorrect way of saying it. Because that's silly. Anyway, here we go. Locrian mode. Flat second, flat third, flat five, flat six, and flat seven. play through everything back to back now so you can hear the modes changing as I play. in there. Uh, hopefully that was clear, uh, clear enough example. And then you also asked what chords I tend to hit if I run through a mode and whatnot. So if I do, so the Ionian, Lydian, Mixolydian, a major chord will fit with the root note. So you can play the Ionian mode. And it makes sense. Major scale, finish with the major chord. Lydian because of this one, three, and five, and Mixolydian with the one, three, five. You can also do a major chord on that. So all three modes here for major chord. You got your Ionian, Lydian, Mixolydian. Aeolian, your minor scale, 
Makes sense to play a minor chord. Dorian has a 1 flat 3 and a 5, so that also gets a minor chord. Phrygian, again, 1 flat 3 and flat, uh, no, just 1 flat 3 and 5 are present in that mode. So, minor chord again. Locrian has a 1 flat 3 flat 5 found in that. So a diminished chord or a diminished triad chord will fit at the end of that. So everyone's least favorite chord, or most favorite chord to forget anyway. They hear it, they don't like the abrasive sound it has, but it's found in a major scale. Yes, indeed it is. And remember, all seven modes that we've covered are in the major scale. Just starting on a different point within the same scale. All right, questions, let me know, or we can just talk about that next class. And we can certainly cover some chord theory, very basic stuff of chord stuff. Um, I guess that covers it. I will see you on Wednesday.